in? Uh, could be three months, six months. Three to six months, huh? Yeah, it takes some time. So one company bought all those trucks, huh? Right. That's crazy. A buddy of mine, Austin, told me about this place. So I called out here and they're like, yeah, we got some trucks. Come take a look. Uh, a lot of dump trucks. So that's what we're going to do here real quick is hop out and uh, take a quick look at them. Some have snow plows on them, but uh got my buddy Sean with me. And then we're going to get our butts back over here. If I see something I like, I'm going to get the process started and uh, we'll move from there. But we're only about six minutes from where we're playing travel ball. So me and Sean, we got about an hour here and then we got to get back over there and uh, we're going to be watching some softball. So let's hop out here and check it out. You coming out with me? Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So the trucks that we're going to be interested in are going to be this line right here. So uh, this company here, this uh, dealership here actually stocks these a lot of times, probably a lot more whenever there's not such a shortage. But uh yeah, we're gonna take a look. This one's a dually. It doesn't, it doesn't have the bed I want, but uh, just gonna take a look here real quick. Uh, 64,000. Okay, it's a 350. Let's take a look here. Uh, this is a little bit older. No, 2021. Uh, MSRP 46,640. It's not bad. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think that would uh, do some work, huh? Here's one without a bed. 63,000. 2021, 550. That's a big boy. There's red. I do like this red color, but, you know, we rock the white. So, I mean, I pretty much got to stick to white, black, gray. Not a whole lot of colors. All right, 54 on this one has the uh, nice, I believe that's aluminum or maybe stainless. I think it's aluminum. Here's a 550 with the extended cab. Probably going to be pretty close to the same price as that red one. Yep, 53 on it. So anytime you guys hear that, you just have to remember taxes and all of that stuff are going to go into effect as well. This one might be sold, no sticker on it anymore. Regular cab, this one has no bed. I'm not even gonna look at the ones with no bed. So here's one with the Western on it, contractor grade. Let's take a look at it real quick. It's got a bed, 350. Uh, we're at 44. I'm wondering if there's, let me see here. Does that include the price of the plow? So yeah, I don't see the plow on any of this. So I guarantee that's probably a six to seven, eight thousand dollar add-on, so. I don't want a straight blade as it is. I'd rather have something without one. No bed on this one. Another dump truck. Where are we at here? Regular cab, 41. This is a 2021. A little bit bigger of a dump bed on this one, I believe. Not bad, not bad. It's a 350. Dually, red dump, white dump. Where are you going, bro? Let's see if I can glance at it. Fifty thousand. Here's a five fifty. Man, look at the box on that thing. Got a big old chrome box seat in there behind the cab. Be good to put shovels and rakes and all that stuff in. I don't know if a backpack would fit in that or not. Here's a 250 with a plow on it, another Western. Both red though, let me see if I can see a number. 46, it looks like 45. Here's another one. I'm just moving through these real quick guys. I already have in my head what I want or don't want. And to be honest with you, all of these trucks are a potential option at this point, if they're not all sold, because that's a big thing. You get in here and they're like, oh, those are all sold. So. You just never know. Here's a long bed. It's got a truck bed in the back, 250. Or I meant a toolbox in the back, not a truck box. Oh, let me scoot here through the mirrors. Hey, put these babies close. So you're looking at 43 here, probably about 52 after taxes. 
Uh, oh, this is a 2022, guys. So 2022. Boom. It's 2022. 2022, bud. Just plain Jane work truck, guys. That's all we need. That's a 250. Here's a 250. Another XL. Hey, careful back there, bro. Those move. Uh, this one's 43. What is it? This is another XL, so pretty much basic. Uh, once you get into the XLTs, you get a little more of the upgrades and everything. Uh, like this probably has crank. No, it's got power windows. Power windows, power locks. That's I'm surprised on the XL for this one. So yeah, one more red one here. I don't see anything else in the parking lot. We're gonna drive to the other side just to be sure. So you're looking at about 45 for this one here as well. Is this a 22? Yep, 2022. So another XL. Tire seems small. So yep, real quick guys, that's what they got. And believe it or not, I went Monday and I was gonna order a truck online from Ford. Uh, and like you can add like the cab lights on different mirrors you can add whatever you want chrome bumper or chrome chrome grills they have a blackout version now which is really sweet looking and you can put it on the white trucks and black trucks and uh you can change out your wheels these are just real basic wheels and tires rims same thing steel rims and tires you can spend as much as you want you can take that truck right there that plain jane with nothing on it for about thirty-seven thousand. And it can be up to 55,000 and a few little upgrades. So I'm trying to rush a little bit, guys, because we got about an hour here before Miley softball game. Uh, I do some, I do see some things here I like, uh, but we're gonna check the other side real quick, and then maybe we come back. Yeah, these are all sold. So sold, 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 sold. But he said there was a couple down here towards the end. He said he knows there's one with a tarp that's not sold yet. Dually, I really don't want a dually. This one here, he said's not sold yet. It's a 350. Uh, this is a 18. So yeah, guys, look at that. I mean, just as much as the brand new ones, guys. Just as much. Might even be a little bit more. This is an 18, 47 grand. We saw some 21s over there, I believe for 45. This is absolutely crazy. This is a 350, I believe those were 250s, so. Let's take a look. This one has a boss plow set up on it already. I really don't want a truck that's had plowing on it though. Let me take a look, take a look under here. Honestly, it doesn't look too bad, you know, compared to like rust and stuff on them. Like this is just from hooking and unhooking, but I wonder what plows came with it. Let's see where we're at here. 57,000, it's 2020. How much, how many miles? 14,000 miles on it, so it's only a year old. Somebody plowed with this thing literally a year. Tinted the windows, that's why that plow setup's not really, probably plowed one year with it. I just wanna know what plow comes with it though. That wouldn't be too bad. Looks like it needs a, uh, little buff out there they got a little too much wax on it so we got a chevy gmc denali ram i wanted to check this white one down here i'd like to stick with white this one's got a big plow on it already here them guys mowing i think those are the guys that went by earlier so we got a 2500 heavy duty is this a western Yep, another Western V plow. Nice. Let's check the number on it. It's on the back window on this one. Uh, 38,000. It's a 15. Six feet automatic. Mileage. Dude, this thing's only got 13,000 miles and it's a 15. What? That's a 2015 with 13,000 miles. I don't know. 
2015 with 13,000 miles, guys. Because these, these ones here already got this sun plow already set up on them. They're pre-owned. Uh -huh. These two white ones here on the left. The ones with dually, the ones with single wheel well. Hold it. Hold it. Go for it. But you don't, I mean, you want to do rain. You can take a look at it real quick. Thousand miles on fifteen. Yeah. I think these ones on the left are the two single cabs we just pulled up on the website. Okay. All right. Um. Don't don't. Thank you, sorry. Uh, that's a sink. Five fifty. No chance. Did you, um, you don't need something like that, right? No, I mean, the, the don't bed would be an option for sure. Okay. Uh, but I, yeah, I don't need the utility box. Gotcha. Didn't know you were getting a golf cart, golf cart ride today, did you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> My daughter's playing in a travel ball tournament just around the corner. Yeah. So I've been waiting all week to come over here and I got an hour before a game starts. I'm like, I'm going to go check these trucks out real okay. quick. So what do you want to check out? You want to check out the 350 dumps? Yeah, want... let's look at them first and then we can move on down. Somebody's eating a ton of popcorn, huh? He likes this Cobra GT500. Yeah, that one. Oh yeah. All right guys, so looking at potentially ordering the truck in now, I've been told it can be next year. Some dealerships like this one, they buy so many and sell so many, uh, they have a bit more of a pool. So I can get a truck ordered a bit quicker they're looking at right now how long it will take for me to get this truck potentially if I do order it. All of those prices I showed you on those stickers, guys, just go ahead and wipe that out, okay? Because those are just sticker prices from the order. You can add five, ten, twenty thousand dollars $20,000 onto every one of those trucks, just different models and different step ups. Like, I was in complete shock. So, and the trucks are there's just no not enough trucks all those ones on that back lot that i showed you all those white ones uh you probably already seen at this point one landscape company came in here and bought all of them so it, it's like feast or famine right now unfortunately so <clears throat> we're gonna see what we can do here they're over there trying to build this thing out get a hold of ford to see how long it'll take me to get it and uh because i told him i said if it's going to be more than three months i can't do it because i got to have this thing for plowing season so december at the latest we can run one truck early on in the snow plow season but if we get a bad season which there's no guarantee uh you know we'll be hurting so we need two for sure all right guys so what do we do sean <laughs> we bought a truck guys now we're not taking it home today with us because we had to order it because there's nothing available. Oh, got to unlock doors. All right, guys. So out here now I can actually talk a little bit louder. The good thing is we placed an order for our truck. The bad news is we don't know how long exactly it's going to take. So we're aiming for eight weeks, so two months. Uh, we're hoping it doesn't go any longer than that because this truck will have to go in to get more work done to be ready for Spencer Lawn Care to uh, make money hopefully this winter. But uh, yeah, I'm super stoked about this purchase. I'm happy about it. I don't feel bad about it. Uh, we got a decent deal on it for what we're going through right now in the world. The biggest thing is we got to wait, you know, months to get it. So uh, you're not getting any of these trucks out here right now and taking them home with you uh, simply because most of them are sold and the ones that aren't sold, the dealerships, because it's so competitive right now, uh, you know, the prices are up like way up so some of those trucks guys that were showing you know 45 50 thousand bucks uh once you get into the computer pricing on them and everything guys i'm not kidding you they're 55 60 70 thousand dollars so one dump truck over there that i was really interested in uh it was 49 yeah i believe it was 49 or 50 and that was the sticker price the dealership price is seventy thousand bucks so uh that's just how competitive it competitive it is in this market right now and like he said nobody else can get these trucks so super stoked 
truck is ordered it is on its way officially i got documented proof we put a good down payment on it and uh yeah it's on its way at least i know that is done and out of the way now it's just a waiting game and i hope i hope we don't get put on one of those lists to uh hold us back for a long period of time so did upgrade a few little things on it but you know it's a work truck that's what this truck's gonna do i don't need the bells and whistles for it but it did we did have basic things that we wanted in another work truck you know backup camera stuff like that so uh we made sure we covered those p's and q's so now you guys gotta wait just like i do and sean boy does to uh see this bad boy in a few months so uh as always guys keep mowing keep growing keep making money boys we'll talk to you later take you out peace Bye. Bye.